I was reading this cool article and I think my lower attention span audience should see this too. So this blog post is about how I grew my open source project and I'm damn sure you all have tried to grow your open source side project so that people contribute to it but sadly it didn't work. But before promoting that open source project you should confirm these things. Read me is the first thing people see when they visit your project. Make sure it's clear and concise. At a minimum it should include some demo screenshot, features of the project, installation guide, use it guide and of course description. Well honestly I won't recommend GPT maxing while writing read me the human touch is still better and also if you don't know the markdown I already have a video if you want people to contribute in your project, you need to provide a contribution guide. It should include how to set up the development environment, coding style of the project, the format of the commit message, what are the issues that are good for beginners. When people start using your project, they might encounter bugs or have feature requests. To make it easier for them to report issue, you should provide an issue template. Well, creating your issue template is easy. You can just follow this doc on your screen. Now let's see what you can do to promote your next billion dollar open source project. You can share your project on the platform where your target community is active. For the example of this blog post, the NeoVim community is pretty active on Reddit, so he shared the project on NeoVim. When it comes to sharing on social media, it's crucial to provide a visual element. People are more likely to click on a post with a GIF image than a plain text. When I say write articles, I don't mean you have to write posts about your project. Often people are not interested in about promotion of your project. Instead, you can write articles related to the problem and your project solves this. Apart from actively promoting your project, you can also leverage events like Hacktober Beast to attract contributors. It's an annual event that encourages people to contribute to open source projects throughout October. Honestly, I don't like such events because they promote spamming more than open source contribution. Building an open source project is not a one-time thing. You need to maintain it to keep it alive. User feedback, bugs, report, feature requests will keep coming and you have to handle them properly. Using labels to help them organize issue, good first issue, enhancement, bugs. After a while, your project might develop more feature or even a release of a major version. You can get back to the community of the promotion stage and share the update. So that's all in this blog post and I guess you have an idea now. Personally, I would suggest you to making content around your project that gives you more reach that's it i'll see you next time cuties